Did you know that New Jeans just reached number one on the Billboard 200? New Jeans land both their first number one and first entry on the Billboard 200 albums chart, dated August 5th, as their second EP Get Up debuts atop the list. The set earned 126,500 equivalent album units in the US in the week ending July 27th, according to Luminate, mostly driven by CD sales of the album. The Korean quintet brings a second all-female group to number one on the Billboard 200 in less than a year, following Blackpink's Born Pink last September. They are the only two albums by all-female groups to reach number one in the last 15 years. Before Blackpink, the last all-female group to lead the tally was Donaby Kane with Welcome to the Dollhouse in April of 2008. Also in the top 10 of the new Billboard 200, the all-star Barbie soundtrack bows at number 2, with the biggest week, by units earned, for a theatrical film soundtrack in over four years. Plus, Greta Van Fleet claims its third top 10 charting effort as Starcatcher starts at number 8. The Billboard 200 chart ranks the most popular albums of the week in the US based on multi-metric consumption as measured in equivalent album units, compiled by Luminate. Units comprise album sales, track equivalent albums, TA, and streaming equivalent albums, SEA. Each unit equals one album sale, or 10, individual tracks sold from an album, or 3,750 ad-supported or 1,250 paid-slash-subscription on-demand official audio and video streams generated by songs from an album. The new August 5, 2023 dated chart will be posted in full on Billboard's website on August 2nd. For all chart news, follow at Billboard and at Billboard Charts on both Twitter and Instagram. Of GetUp's 126,500 equivalent album units earned in the week ending July 27, album sales comprise 101,500, with 99% of that sum driven by CD sales and 1% via digital download, SEA units comprise 24,500, equaling 34.39 million on-demand official streams of the set's six tracks, and TEA units comprise 500. Like many K-pop releases, the CD edition of Get Up was issued in collectible CD packages, three main versions, available in 14 different iterations, with different covers and packaging individualized to the different group members, and all with a set of randomized branded merchandise inside, including photo books, lyric books, and photo cards. Most of the permutations of the CD edition of the album saw their contents housed in a branded bag, which was then contained inside a box. The set was only available for purchase as a CD or a digital download album. Barbie marks the highest charting soundtrack in more than a year, since Encanto led the list for nine non-consecutive weeks, January-March 2022. Barbie is also the highest debut for a full-length theatrical film soundtrack since the Beyoncé-led The Lion King. The Gift also opened at number two four years ago, August 3, 2019, chart. The Barbie album features new music from Billie Eilish, Dua Lipa, Lizzo, Nicki Minaj and Ice Spice and Sam Smith, among many others, and even a pair of tracks from the film's co-star Ryan Gosling. Don't miss out on the hottest band of the year New Jeans.